One of the very helpful tools in posting bank transactions is bank reconciliation journals, payment reconciliation journals. I will show you how to use it in the system. You can treat payment reconciliation journals as a one statement, a statement for one day or one week in bank account. So it's up to you how long will be the statement, but one journal will give us one statement in the system. You just click new journal and pick the proper account number and hit OK. This is the place where you put the transaction manually or Im by importing them from, from text files and you can apply those transactions directly into vendor or customer transactions posted in the system. Let's prepare some, some transactions here. We will find, for example, some bank fees uh, on, on one statement. We can find transaction fee. We can also find some payment for invoice or this kind of descriptions. We can find some amounts there. So bank fee, some transactions fee, some payments for invoice and some payments for the other side. Okay, uh, when you put the amount, system will automatically calculate the difference amount and now it waits for our applyment. You can apply manually, of course only those you, you think are connected with customers. Let's find out with the, this one. Just hit apply manually. System will open all transactions that can be used here. You can just click apply and the system will apply the entry and we'll put the difference as a zero and choose the customer, customer number and its dimensions and other information. You can of course do it here system knows that this is a negative amount so he thinks that this is a vendor transaction it can be this this vendor transaction when it's bank fees or other other bank transactions you it's all, uh, almost uh, always used as an account as a GL account number. It's also very easy to to map. You can use map text to account function here. So each time bank fee appears on the statement, it will be automatically given the proper ac account. So just click map text to account and put the account for this transaction. Okay. And this one also can be matched. Okay. As you can see, system has matched all the transactions and the, all the appliment are done here. Okay, so let's for now let's remove those applications. I will show you one more function that is available here. Okay, I have put some additional description here. I have put document number in the description. And of course, as 
from the beginning we have map text to account function here so we have those accounts also those descriptions also are mapped so now we can use apply automatically system will try to apply the entries if the difference is zero in each row system did the work now we can post them directly into the system and we can check of course on bank accounts and the ledger entries what had what changed on the bank account ledger entries <laughs>